Hi my lovelies, welcome back to my channel. I'm Deborah, and I'm so glad you're here. Uh, today we are going to be flirting with this little flirty razor cut by Raquel Welch. This is Fascination in SS Wheat and it is, let me look at the color just to make sure, RL 1422SS. This is just a dark blonde with some light blonde platinum highlights running through it. Cute little uh, razor cut. She um, is heat friendly, so you can style her. You can do a lot of different things with her if you would like to. So um, if you will give me a moment, I am going to take her off so we can take a look at the inside. And I will be right back. Here we go. Um, she is one of the Raquel Welch uh, memory caps. After you've got her on just a few minutes, she just molds to your head. She's so comfortable. She only weighs two and a quarter ounces, so you can imagine when you're wearing her, you just don't hardly feel anything at all. Now we've got the um, fel velvety felt front. It does not have a lace front, just uh, just your regular cap, just a basic cap. We've got the covered ear tabs with the stays. And I always remind you to get those stays um, bent right up against your face. And the reason I like to remind you, when I took her off just now to show her to you, one of those stays was not pushed up against my face. I don't know if y'all recognize that idea in the... Uh, the piece before so just always remember it's worth the reminder to always remember she does have the uh, velcro adjuster straps let's see how she stretches oh yeah she stretches pretty good so I think she would be larger head friendly I had to of course pull her in just a little bit to fit mine um, the front, we've got the nice lace front with uh, permatease. Again, that's kind of my style. I like the short, uh, kind of big hair. And you got to have the permatease to get the, the lift if that's what you're going after. If you don't care for permatease, she might not be the one for you because there's um, ample permatease in there. So let's take a look at this color up close real real cute color it's uh, as you can see it's blonde it's rooted it has a little bit of a dark root I would say probably maybe around uh, six I'm not sure but I think and uh, gold with those blonde and platinum highlights just the the highlights are just done so well on this I, I really like it so now we are going to uh, put her back on I'll give you all the measurements and we'll take a look at her all the way around hold on okay I'm back and um, so I'm going to do a quick turn so you can see it on all sides. You're going to notice something a little different today. I don't have her tucked. I thought, well, I'll just wear her down so y'all could take a peek at her without her being tucked. Now here we go with the back. It has uh, very good coverage on the nape. We're going to come on around. Let's take a look at this left side. And back around to the front. Okay, let's talk about her measurements. Um, the front is four and a half inches. The crown is only four, so that front's longer than the crown. The sides are three inches. You can uh, you can pull them towards your face. You can kind of. Um, swoosh them back even though she's short there there's still options for ways to style her uh the back is three inches like i said it's a razor cut it goes um you know just three inches all the way down and it has two and a quarter inch nape so you do get good coverage 
there's one thing I wanted to talk about. My head is a little bit on the smaller side. I've told you uh, I'm 21 and a quarter round. And I don't know what my measurements are from ear to ear. But I do know because I wear glasses, when I put her on, I get these ear tabs pulled tight, you know, get her situated like she's supposed to be. A lot of times I put on my glasses and it, it just feels like they're they're being uh, knocked out of place. So a lot of times, I don't know if this happens to any of you other ladies that wear glasses, I will have to uh, take these sides and pull them up just a little bit. Let me show you what I'm talking about here. Just pull it up just a little on each side so that my glasses will slide right in there without any problem at all. So, you know, that might be something to try if you have a problem with your glasses um, wearing wigs. Now, I like this wig a lot. I don't wear a whole lot because I, I've said before in earlier reviews that I'm leaning a little bit more towards the um, the browns and the silvers. I do like the blondes. Um, they say blondes have more fun. I haven't found that they really do. <laughs> I just, uh, um, I think with my coloring, I'm leaning more towards the browns. So you will see me review a few of my blondes, but um, mostly I'm going to be going more to the silver, more to the, the, the browns. So anyway, would I buy her again? I don't know. Um, I like her. I enjoy wearing her, but I have... Um, Lizzie by Renee of Paris, if you've seen that review, and Lizzie has the same kind of little um, flirty layers in the back, and I prefer Lizzie over this one. If I had not gotten Lizzie, I might be telling you a different story. I might be saying, oh sure, I would buy her again. I don't know for a fact that I will. Nothing against the wig. The wig is fine. It's comfortable. It's cute as can be. But my preference, I believe, is the Renee of Paris Lizzie. So maybe it's the color of Lizzie that I like. I, I don't know. But anyway, this is a great little wig. She's um, would be in a uh, just a basic cap, not expensive. I think she's probably about a hundred and. $39, $140 if you catch uh, one of the 30% sales, which most of the sites have them very often. You can usually find it on at least one site all the time. You know, you're getting her for a really good price. So, ladies, if you would leave comments below if you uh, like this color, if you'd like to see more uh, reviews in this color, if you'd like to see more silver reviews, if you'd like to see shorter pixies than this, uh, if you would, just let me know. And also, as always, I ask you to please like, and if you haven't sub subscribed yet, would you please subscribe? And before I leave you, got to leave you with my motto, it doesn't take much to look like a million bucks. Bye-bye.